Hello friends, welcome to a an Immortal Treasure 2 preview of all the spells that are upgraded via the beautiful items that you get in this bad boy. Uh, since Neil is not here, I will be doing this video this time around. And the first one looks like it's Sven and it looks like it's his ultimate. We of course, we'll be doing a chest opening video afterwards. Uh, that'll be a separate video entirely. So let's look at the effect itself. Ooh. Very flat, extremely flashy. See what it looks like when he hits somebody. No difference there. But the effect itself is uh, very, very noticeable. So we'll do a couple zoomed in ones. I think it's cool. Very nice indeed. All right, who is next? We got Magnus. This is also his ultimate. Wow. Got some big ultimates, actually. A little bit surprising. Oh my. This one's even more flashy than the Sven one, not gonna lie. Wow. And it's actually a golden. It feels like it's a. would be a rare, but this is a guaranteed item that you will get if you have enough chests. Next is Slardar and also his ult, Corrosive Haze. Goodness gracious, this is an all ultimate chest. Ooh, that looks cool. I like this one. Oh, I can't zoom in on him, so I have to do it this way. So he's being surrounded by little fishies. Wow, that's a really cool effect. I like this one a lot. Not that the other ones were bad, but this one is really good. Very cool. Put on a creep. Good boy. Okay, so that's Slardar. Next is Troll Warlord. Not his ultimate, it is Whirling Axes. So there's gonna be two versions, obviously. That's pretty flashy for a troll warlord. And that's even flashier, a fiery version. Okay, let's see if there's any kind of effect for the slow, not really. And then the blind, not really. But again, troll has some of the least flashy abilities in the game, I would say. So this is way more flashy than we're used to seeing out of him. Yeah, that is actually a lot of blue. All right. After Troll Warlord, continuing with the guaranteed sets, Witch Doctor, it is Voodoo Restoration. Okay. That is very emerald-like. I like it. Uh... Let's create hero axe ally. Let's see if there's any effect on him, not really. Looks very nice. It's got little uh it almost looks like it's not emeralds, but it's almost like reverse ash. I don't know what to call this, these little things flying up. The cool little particle effects, I like it. And we have Silencer, Arcane Curse. Okay, so his face adorns the top of the hero. I keep forgetting I can't do that. That's pretty cool. Stop attacking! Stop attacking! That's yeah, a decent one. I mean, Sansa is another one of those where he doesn't really have crazy uh, particles, typically. Jakiro. Oh, it's the ultimate. Mm. Oh, my goodness. So, if you remember the 
the item on the back of the collector's cache. It actually reminds me of this. Of course, there's a blue tinge or blue hinge to this as well. A tinge? Tinge. This looks really, really good. Yeah. This one is, uh, it's really the blue that makes it way different than the other one. And then the rocks and, and whatnot that follow suit with the, the collector's cash. I believe that's the last guaranteed one. So Witch Doctor will get a golden version of this. Does it change? No, it's just as prominent throughout all levels, it looks like. Okay. Then from Witch Doctor, we go to slow oh, a golden version of a Slardar. Ooh. <laughs> you know what's fun? I, I actually think I prefer the non-golden for this one. I don't know how you guys feel about that. Not that this doesn't look cool. It actually turns his cape and stuff gold as well. It's like you're giving cosmetics to uh, <laughs> to the enemy. I'm making you look cooler. I still think I like the original one more than that. Uh, from Slardar, and this is the last one. Uh, Ursa, wow. So wait, what is this? What is this? Oh, it changes the taunt as well to add this little cuddly guy on the back. Holy shit, that's really cool. Uh, what does this change though? Changes Earth Shock. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be a big Earth Shock. Wow. And it makes a new sound as well. It's a little cub on his back. Uh, let's let's redo this one. All right. Let me just. Because I didn't mean to make him, uh, full level. Because I don't want the A to be that big. Okay. So this is how it's going to look for most of the game. That's pretty cool. A little bit surprised it's not, not, I think it looks better as blue, but I'm surprised considering it's the rarest thing in this chest that it's, uh, not golden. But I'm kind of happy about that. And... Really, the thing you're getting is this little cuddly guy on his back. Which looks insanely cute. Oh my goodness. That is so, so awesome. <laughs> Alright, so that those are the effects of this Immortal Treasure 2. Uh, by the time you watch this, I will be already recording and probably uploading the chest opening. And I'll also give my ratings of... Uh, how I feel about each individual item. So let us know what you think in the comments. Till next time, Suns fan, signing out.